All right, guys, JJ Sports Breaks, 9-11, June the 5th, 2017. We are live for a six-box half-case PYT of 2017 Diamond Kings Baseball. Uh, this is the second inner case from the master case we broke over the weekend. So we're going to crack this one. We're going to pull six boxes from it. I'm going to mark the other six, and we'll save them for later in the week. I don't know. I may do pack wars with those or something like that instead of more PYTs. But I'm gonna get another master case at the end of the week because they're still gonna they're still gonna qualify for the Father's Day pack, so that'll give us a good chunk of, of those when they come around next week. What's up, Jeremy? What's up, Adam? How are y'all doing? And I'm going to announce the winner of the photo caption at the end of this. I've pretty much already got my mindset on one, so. I do too. I, I absolutely love DK. I don't know what it was about this year. I don't know if it was the timing of the release and just where it where it dropped, but it just it didn't get the credit that it deserves this year. The set's beautiful. Right, Adam. Yeah, that's uh I've got a I've got an idea for that one. So I've got a I gotta lay it out tonight and see what it's gonna look like, but I've got some I've got some ideas for finest because the checklist is so unbalanced it's not even funny. It'd be three or four teams carrying the weight of the entire case, then everybody else would have to be dirt cheap. So you're gonna see a lot of that this year. Because of, you know, a lot of the rookie-based products, that's the way it's going to be. Because the Red Sox, the Yankees, the Astros, the Braves, the Cubs, they're loaded. Outside of that, once you get outside of there, there's not a lot of popularity. There are some good rookies out there, but they're not going to demand what the, the top five are going to bring. And that doesn't help the five or big market teams, too. And then once Bellinger drops into the scene, then it's going to be even. It'll be a little more spread, I guess, once the once the Dodgers rejoin the ranks. But all right, guys. So let's get started here. Here is your sealed case. There's the top. There's the bottom. case up in the top left corner. Well, pitchers typically always get underestimated. There's just never, I don't know, people just always tend to look for the, the everyday players first until they do something extraordinary like Strasburg, you know. But I agree, he'll be a stud. All right, before I get ahead of myself, do you want right or left side? All right, I got one vote for left. Does anybody else have an opinion? Important decision here. The Babe Ruth is on one side. Which side is it? All right, we got one vote for left, one vote for right, and another vote for left. So left it is. Daniel was the swing vote. So we're going to move the right side over to the corner here. Get those out of the way. Left is now the heavy favorite. All right, guys, there's your six. Good luck. I 
I don't know. Um, I'm not going to do it tomorrow night. I only have four cases of Finest, so I probably, I'll probably do the other half of this sometime this weekend. I'm not going to do it tomorrow, and I don't want it to, you know. I know it won't fill on Wednesday, so I'm not going to. I'll probably wait and do it this weekend. And I've got a fresh Master Case coming in this weekend, too, for next week. Because next week we only have Top Series 2. I'll do one case break of that. It'll be a modified format. There will be rules, but I'll, I'll figure out some way to do it so that we cover it. And then that'll be all that we do with that one. Finest is already through the roof. So I'll probably have four cases, and that'll be about it. Yeah, I'll... Well, while they're giving away, like, Panini's doing a promotion right now for if I buy Diamond Kings, I get, you know, a couple Father's Day packs for every box that I buy. So, while they're doing promotions like that, you know, they'll usually do it for the Father's Day, they'll do it for the kickoff, they'll do it for the um, Black Friday, Cyber Monday, stuff like that. They always do it to help push some of their products. Just every time they do those, I always buy Diamond Kings. Whenever it qualifies, so... Because I love Breaking Diamond Kings, but I love free stuff too. Roberto Clemente. Bill Dickey. Insert. Darvish. Texas. <laughs> oh, no joke, Adam. I love stuff like that. I met like 40 new people today because of that tornado post. People that I didn't even know were in the group. It never fails. Stan Musial. Decoy. Herb Pennock. And your next hit for the Padres, Jan Jarvis Solarte. San Diego, 20 of 25. Brian! Brian P., welcome to the group. Congrats on your first hit. I haven't announced the winner yet. I'm torn. Like, I've, I've got a couple of them that I like. So, you know, I've probably should have done something a little different, but I have a few that I like, so I'm trying to make my final decision on which one. That is the wrong size top loader. Yes, I, I agree, Andrew, or not Andrew, Adam. It's okay, though. I know who to tag on upcoming breaks now. <laughs> Kirby Bucket. Carson Kelly to 99. Ernie Banks. Carson Fulmer for the White Sox. Chris Bryant, frame for the Cubs. I might do something like that. I might get a third party to make the selection. Ty Cobb. Somebody who's not, or who can be impartial, I guess. 50 of 99, Ty Cobb. There was probably three that really just made me laugh maybe maybe four 
no more than five. The rest were kind of like, eh, eh, yeah, yeah, I can see. And then the Brandon Cooks to 99 jokes got old. <laughs> I was like, come on, guys. I just thought it was funny of all places that that happened in Canada. You don't ever think of Canada as a place where somebody's going to get their picture taken mowing the grass in front of uh, in front of a tornado. It's like Kansas scenery, you know. know how I found it. It was like something I just, I think I was on Twitter this morning and then I never get on Twitter. I have a Twitter account for the, for the page. So I was looking at that and then it popped up as one of the trending stories or whatever. And it was funny because they said that the, the guy cutting the grass, you know, they interviewed him after or whatever and asked him what he thought about it. And he was like, oh, you know, the, the, uh, the picture makes it look a lot closer than it really was. You know, I was I was keeping my eye on it. <laughs> I was like, who says something like that? You got a tornado literally in your backyard, and you're out there cutting your grass, and you're just you're keeping an eye on it, huh? Okay. <laughs> Now, I don't know if it came from a satirical website or not. I just, like I said, I just saw it and tossed it on the on the group page and let y'all have fun with it. Because I just, it was one of those that I was scrolling through and it just caught my attention. I was like, really? Is this real right now? I have my doubts, but who knows? Maybe somebody can do some fact checking. <laughs> Decoy. Jordan Patterson for the Rockies. Moncada, SP. For the Nationals, Daniel Murphy. What? You had a box from DA and the first pack was opened with four cards. That's dumb. I've never had a problem with them. I've ordered several things from them. I don't order often from there because it takes like four days to get here. But if they've got something for a good deal, then I'll do it. Josh Donaldson. Ernie Banks. Seattle. Ooh. Five of forty nine. Gaylord Perry. Seattle Mariners, Tyler H. Nice hit. I double check the Solarte.
It was number 20. I'm sure you are watching it, but I want to make sure we didn't miss a jackpot. Nice hit. All right. Seeger. Don Mattingly to 99. Altuve, SP. Rizzo, SP. Sano, frame. Artist proof, Altuve to 99. Betts, SP. And that is the end of box number two. Number three. Who do I get my supply from? I have actually had a business license for this. So I go through a couple of different distributors that are here in the southeast. And then, uh, you know, like I said, on occasion, I'll order from David Adams. I have bought you know, maybe two cases in total, like in an emergency situation from blowout. Uh, but mostly I stick to my two distributors that are here locally. Because they are, one of them is literally 40 minutes from me, so I can drive and pick up if they have if they have everything that I need. And they've got locations across the United States, so I have multiple places to order from. Um, and then the other one is just on the other side of Atlanta. So they're next day shipping to me. It died off, I think, in 2013. America's pastime, I think. I'm trying to remember, I'm trying to remember what year it was. I want to say it was 13. Because we did a break or two of it at one point. Five of 99, Freddie Freeman. Christian Yelich. For Miami. Andrew Benintendi for Boston. Evening, Joe. Alex Reyes for the Cardinals. Yeah, that's right. I did play the one one Tommy John. Yeah, that was uh, 2013. America's pastime. And I can't get that anymore, unfortunately. Somebody bought it all up. Gregory Polanco. Braden Shipley to 99. Daniel Murphy, SP.
That was a fun product. You know, it was like a... It was a very, very uh, cheapish form of National Treasures. I think it's really kind of what got National Treasures baseball started, if I'm not mistaken. Clemente. I could be completely wrong on that, though, so don't go into that. Because NT baseball didn't come around until 14, right? Or was it a lot sooner? What do we have here? Jersey Kings. Ooh. Ooh, two of five. Lefty Gomez. Jersey Kings. Very nice. Two of five on the lefty. That's going to be a nice random. That's going to be a nice random. And that's another reason why I love Diamond Kings. You've got all kinds of goodies in here. And it's such a good price point, too. You don't have to worry about it running up to $140 a box like everything Topps is doing right now. Say Oscar Hernandez for the Houston Astros. For the Atlanta Braves, Mike Fultonevich. He's really stepped up his game a little bit. He's doing a lot better now. 72 of 99. Fulty. For the Bravos. Going to Charlie. Larson. And that's the end of box number three. So a good start to this break.
Almost. All right, here we go. Box number four. Hits are on the top of this one. Lindor. It's a 99. 90 of 99. Francisco Lindor for the Indians. Andrew Benintendi, SP. Decoy. David Paulino, frame. And your next hit for the Pirates. Four of 49, Josh Bell. A little off the sticker, but uh, nice hit for the Pirates. Ryan A. Pirates it well in this. Rookie signatures. Reyes, SP. Nelly Fox to 99. Mm -mm. Nope. Seeger. Larson. Verlander. Trout SP Fergie Jenkins Daniel Murphy Madison Bumgarner for the Giants that's the end of box number four. Number five. Number five, Addie Russell to 99 for the Cubs. John McGraw, 
Chris Bryant SP. Decoy. Hack Wilson SP. Don Larson, Frame. Kiwi Reese SP. Rio. Madison Bumgarner SP. Should start seeing a few hits. Should have two to hit. And the first one is going to be a Corey Kluber. Another one for the Indians. Corey Kluber. Mike Trout SP again. Decoy. Don Larson. Don Larson shows up a whole lot in this. And for the Chicago White Sox, number to 299, Carson Fulmer, rookie auto. Carson Fulmer. Uh, no Tigers yet, Caden. Not any hits, at least. There's been... There was a Ty Cobb Artist Proof to 99. But that was really all for the Tigers so far. We have one box left. Two more hits to go. Corey Kluber, SP, to finish out box number five. One box left. We're looking for you. Looking for Rockies for you, Darren? Yeah, let's see what we can do. That is uh, the unfortunate issue with the format. It is a lower cost to buy in, but there is a, a chance of getting a skunk for only 12 hits. But, still have a shot at the Yankees random. Last box. Harry Walker to 49. St. Louis. Seeger. Ben Tendi. SP. Decoy.
Alex Reyes. Andrew Benintendi for Boston. Daniel Murphy for Washington. Decoy. Billy Williams for the Cubs. Roberto Clemente for the Pirates. First hit for the Braves, Chipper Jones. Another Chipper Duel Relic. Chipper Jones. Maggio, SP, Decoy, Alex Reyes, Gray Frame, and last but not least, here we go, good luck, good luck, for the Houston Astros to 2.99, Teoscar Hernandez, Teo for the Strohs. Dual Relic Autograph. Don Larson SP. And that is your break, ladies and gents. Thank you very much. I'll get to the Yankees random here in just a moment. Number to forty nine, Harry Walker. I do uh, rookies, SPs, and frames. I don't do all the base. I just do the rookies, the SPs, and the frames. All right, let's see. Setting up for Yankees random. All right, there it is, guys. There's your random. Current time is 9.51. 9.51. Let's post the timestamp here, live at 9.51. All right, we're going to remove the Yankees from here. So we have 29 items. We're going to roll two dice, looking for five or higher. Five times. One, two, three, four. Fifth and final spin, excuse me. The Minnesota Twins and Joe B with the Lefty Gomez. Congratulations, Joe. Minnesota Twins take it. The verification is OQMH or XHX. Copy. We're going to put done here. And we're going to paste that. And that is that, folks. I'll get the YouTube uploaded in a moment. But before we do that, let's give you one more quick recap of the full lineup of hits. And you have the Lefty Gomez. That was just won by the Twins in the random. It's two of five. 
Teoscar Hernandez to 299, Chipper Jones, Corey Kluber, Carson Fulmer to 299, Josh Bell to 49, Lindor to 99, uh, Mike Fultonevich to 99, Gaylord Perry to 49 for Seattle, Daniel Murphy base relic, John Jarvis Salarte 20 of 25 bat kings, and you Darvish. So that is your break, guys. Thank you very much. I do appreciate it. Y'all have a great evening, and we will uh, see you on Wednesday night for 20.